All right, I just want to make a quick video regarding OBS NDI plugin, which is for a dual PC streaming setup. I use this because I don't have a capture card and it works really well. Only problem is the audio desync, which I'm pretty sure everyone gets. I try to find a fix, but there's literally no information anywhere on this. You see people having the problem, but no one is ever fixing it. So I found my own solution, which is fine. Like, it works great, apparently. If you check my old VODs, there's desync. My new VODs don't have desync. So here it is. Basically, you just create NDI outputs for your both audio channels. So this is just my main OBS here on my main PC. So I only have two audio channels. That one doesn't matter. I have desktop audio and mic audio. So what you want to do is right-click the cog, go to filters. This is for my desktop audio. I named it game volume. Add. Dedicated NDI output. Audio only. Close. It's fine. Then mic one, filters, do the same thing, add, dedicate NDI, mic volume, close. Okay, now let's pretend you're on the streaming PC. I'll just go make a new scene, just, you know, pretend this, okay, yeah, your streaming PC should look like this, kind of, just blank slate, except for here it would have the OBS main audio, whatever you named it. So yeah, you're going to just add, usually you just add another source, so just, this is exactly what you do. You add your main footage, highest internal, press OK. Now you have your NDI source, you know, make sure, uh, yeah, that's nothing because the screen's black. Add a new source. The game volume, highest, internal, okay. Now I have your game volume, NDI source, add. Then you have mic volume, and boom, everything's great. But you want to, I have no idea what's going on there, you want to make sure you mute your main footage. That's about it. So you should only have two audio channels, your desktop and your mic. That's the only audio you should have. Make sure everything else is muted. Just, you know, drag the bar all the way down. So yeah, that's about it. Pretty sure it fixes the audio desync. I haven't had any since I did this. So yeah, just add individual sources for the audio and mic, for the game volume and mic, and then mute your main OBS and should be fixed. All right, that's it. Thank you. memes.